Hey everybody, it's Tuesday. I hope you're having a good day. Hope you're having a good week. I hope things are going well. I hope that in all the stuff that's going on, you're finding more and more that Jesus is getting you through it. Because that's the only thing that we have at the end of the day is how much that I love Jesus and how much that I share Jesus with people. Um, this week I've kind of been touching base a little bit on praying and I talked about yesterday how important it is to, um, to really just let God speak to you and for you to listen. The second thing I think we need to do, and have you ever had your parents say, if I told you once, I told you a hundred times. Anybody ever had that? I, how many of you ever said it to your kids? Yeah, there you go. I, I, I'd get there in a minute. I, just be patient with me. So if you do that, I think sometimes God looks at us and says, how many times do I have to tell you? And so the thing I want to talk about as we're preparing our hearts for prayer is the one thing we need to do. And I talked about it a little bit last week, so I'm going to kind of repeat, but I want you to hear it. We need to focus on God. Um, Hebrews 12 says, fix your eyes on Christ Jesus. He's the author and perfecter of your faith. I know I've used that verse a lot because, because I think we need to hear it. I need to hear that because in the midst of everything going crazy, where should my eyes be? Where should my heart be found? In Christ Jesus. And the best way to find God is to focus on Him. Let's look at some verses. Um, Daniel 9.3. I talked about Daniel a little bit yesterday. So I turned my face to the Lord, seeking Him. And that's amazing right there. I, I turned to the Lord my God, seeking Him. So let me ask you. When you wake up, is the first thing you think of is, how am I going to seek God? Or is the first thing you think of, if we're all honest, is how am I going to get through this day? How am I going to get out of this bed? How am I going to put up with whatever we think we're having to put up with? Here's the deal. I just double dog dare you. I put it out there. I'm sorry, but I put it out there. When you have those thoughts, first of all, ask God to take them and then ask God to help him see you. Help you see him. I'll get it right in a minute. You got to see God in everything. You need to find ways to see Jesus. Proverbs 8, 17. I love those who love me and those who diligently seek me when they find me. Amen and amen. Back to Jeremiah. We talked about it yesterday a little bit. 29, 13. You will search for me and you will search for me with all your heart. You will find me. Now there's a theme coming here. It's kind of the heart. The only way we can really find God is if our heart is set on him. So here, here's the thing for the day that I really want you to take away for this Tuesday. Is my heart right with God? And if it is, am I seeking Him? Am I searching Him out? Am I truly focusing on God? Here's the deal that I've learned. When I focus on God, all my issues, problems, fears, things that are overwhelming me, fill in the blank. They all go away because my heart is where God wants me. Now, does it take a while? Sometimes, sometimes it takes me a lot of focusing on God. Can I get an amen? I, there's days that I get that. Yesterday was one of those days for me. We all have days where we forget to focus on God. We forget to fix our eyes on Christ Jesus. Let's look at another verse. Um, Daniel 9.3. So I gave my attention to the Lord and I... I, I and I, I'll try to get. I gave my attention to the Lord to seek Him by prayer. That's it right there. I seek God through prayer. So I ask God, Lord, help me see you. Help me focus on you. Help this be about you, not about me. That's a hard one to pray, isn't it? It's hard. It's tough sometimes. One more, Luke 12, 31. But seek His kingdom, and these things will be given to you as well. It's throughout the Word. One of the things we need to do is seek Jesus, seek God, seek Him who can make everything right. So maybe you're overwhelmed, maybe you're tired, maybe your kids are driving you crazy, maybe you're sick of homeschooling. <laughs> maybe you're tired of putting up with people who aren't very kind to you. Maybe you're tired of TV shows. Eh, let's, that's not that important, but anyway, I get it. Here's the thing I need to get to you. Whatever you're overwhelmed by, with apps, forget the TV shows. <laughs> Whatever you're overwhelmed by, just say, God, help me find you. Help me find you in the mundane, in the tiny, in the big, in the everything. God, let me find you. I'm going to pray that for you right now. Father, not just for those listening, but for myself, may we seek you, may we find you, may we know that everything comes from you. We need you, Jesus. I need you, Jesus. 
May I seek you. May I find you. May you be my hope. In Jesus' name I pray and all God's children say, Amen. Have a great Tuesday.